Hey guys, it's Mel. I'm going to have a couple, um, I guess little mini haul videos. Um, this one and the next one is just going to be um, two, I guess, sort of electronic, we'll call them items, but they're scrapbooking items um, that I just wanted to share. Um, some of you probably already know what this is. Um, i seen it a while ago. Um, I watch HSN like probably a lot of you do um, with crafts and things like that. And this came on once, but I just didn't think much of it. But now that I like a variety of sizes in my photos and I like the ease of printing them at home, um, I do have an HP printer that prints like 4x6 or 5x7, which I only use for like if I need to print it right away. And I, for the most part, go to Walgreens or um, any of the photo printing places and send them off um, and go pick them up because generally it's cheaper that way. But it is good to have, like, if you need to do something right away or a project and you need the photo right away. But this one in particular I got because it's hard to find photos that are small enough that, for me, I don't know, like you guys, <clears throat> I take a lot of pictures. And a lot of times you may not want a full 4x7 of that photo on there, but you, but yet you want to kind of fit in all the photos. So um, that's why I decided to get this. And what this is is a Polaroid um, Instant mobile printer and it's called Polaroid Pogo and it's an older item but I just thought it was neat and I just wanted to share it with you guys. Um, I seen somebody was selling this on Scrapyard but I got mine from eBay and I got it for about $30 um, and I think it probably would have went cheaper but I'll discuss this in another video about eBay because I'll get to rambling. But um, anyway, so it's a Pogo Polaroid um, printer and what it looks like is this. It's this tiny little thing here and you plug one side um, I don't know if this can be charged and it'll be cordless or not, but you, so far I plug the one side into, um, you know, your regular outlet and the other side, you can either plug this to your, it says your PC, you could plug it to your cell phone. Um, I know I heard some people say it doesn't work with the iPhone, but luckily for me, I have a dinosaur phone that, um, it most likely will work with, but I just wanted it from, I actually printed it straight from my camera my you know little camera you don't need any um software it's not you know you don't have to be a computer genius because that i am not um and i got it to work and so basically i'll show you how it opens I won't, um, and then you put the little paper in there but the neat thing about this paper is it's called zinc which means and it's zero ink meaning you never have to buy ink cartridge it's just in the paper so the paper is a little bit pricey um but i was able to find i got 80 sheets for um 16 shipped on amazon so you have to look around um and i know it's probably not you have to look around more i don't know if they stop making these or if they're making them and it's just harder to find the paper or what but you know you can get anything online which is where i got it so the one that i ordered was about 30 dollars, and it came with 80 sheets of paper which was great plus I noticed that when it came, because um, this one was used, it was in mint condition. He said his son never used it. Um, but there was 10 sheets of paper in here, or I don't know how many. It might be, even be more than 10. So I got that plus the 80 sheets, and then I ordered um, another 80 sheets. So, I, so that way I have them um, from Amazon. But this is what they print. Um, so this is, this is Maya, and I see that it's not focusing well. But... Um, it prints a decent it prints a decent photo and this was her at her little lemonade stand this summer um but the neat thing too is that the back comes off and peels like a sticker so you can it's got self-adhesive on it so i just thought this would be neat to add and it says it you know they won't fade for a thousand years they're waterproof they i think they showed somebody put them um i don't know if they dipped it in a cup or what they did and it didn't run or anything so that's always good to know but not that i'm going to be swimming with my photos but um it is nice that it's self-adhesive so you know for that and then i can add you just just print them out right away and add you know a couple of the smaller photos that you might want to be able to fit a little more in so that's what i got there and so check ebay and um check your prices you might be able to get one for even cheaper um so i just want to share that with you guys and um stay tuned i got a i'm going to show i want to do a video i got the um zutter um distress at all. So that's going to be my next video. So stay tuned and I'll show you that. Bye guys.